Hello everyone, we are back with another session of the Algo TA. I just finished recording a video on how to install TensorFlow 2.0 on your favorite desktop computer. So now I've already followed up with how to remove your NVIDIA graphics cards. And this is vitally important for installing TensorFlow 2.0 in the first place. I figured I'd have this supplementary video uh, to show you guys how to actually remove them in case you already have CUDA installed and in case you already have the NVIDIA graphics drivers installed. Because right now my monitors are hooked up to my NVIDIA 1080 graphics card. And as a result, when I tried to remove these drivers, I encountered many system crashes. I couldn't remove them for the longest times for the longest time and uh, there's actually a proper way to do it. And even if you reload and like a new version of Ubuntu, even if you like wipe your operating system and upgrade from an older version of Ubuntu to a new version and say you erase everything on your past version, somehow those NVIDIA graphics card drivers somehow prop propagated their way through that change. So I figured I'd just quickly show you guys how I removed them. Um, I found the Stack Overflow post incredibly, incredibly helpful. How to install or I guess ask Ubuntu post. It looks like Stack Overflow, Stack Exchange. There we go. How to install CUDA 8.0 on Ubuntu 16.04 with NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1080. So I'm using Ubuntu 18.04 and I have the same graphics card. And this is the exact error I got. Uh, NVIDIA kernel module, NVIDIA DRM appears to already be loading your kernel. An error has occurred whenever you try to install or upgrade your CUDA toolkit from 9.0 to 10.2, which is what I did. So one way you can sort of uh, verify this is by typing in NVIDIA-SMI into your terminal. So we're going to do that right now. And the annoying thing is, is you have these, these different processes which are going to continually use uh, your graphics card drivers. And you're not going to be able to disable them or kill them or purge them except by um, sort of logging out of this GUI. So the GUI is how you interact with the computer. Uh, what I recommend is you get your phone, you take a picture of this, these commands, and then you just follow them uh, once you're logged out. So it's also very important to actually purge the drivers as well. Uh, you really need to purge the drivers in order to upgrade the CUDA version. Oh, and just to get out of that, you can type Control Alt F2 and that'll get out of the uh, non-GUI mode. Cool. If you've enjoyed this video, uh, as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Every little bit helps. Also, feel free to leave a comment in the section below saying what you would like me to do next. Uh, looking forward to developing some cool TensorFlow 2.0 tutorials and seeing what we can get up to with that. So as always, hope you enjoyed. See you next time.